Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Autonotom. And, oh, there's a lot of zombies out there. Just noticed that on my mini-map. Yes, um, yeah. Last week we started on Applied Energistics. And that was cool. But I am really struggling with um, setting out my um, immersive engineering stuff. And yeah, because we're gonna we need gonna need to do some more power, so I'm going to have to watch some more YouTube videos and see if I can wrap my head around it. So in the meantime, what we're going to do is we can open up um mechanism. Although to be honest, I well, I'm gonna need more power anyway. Um, expandive and not expanding massively. Uh, modern technology, modern technology. I could do processors that will open up the mechanism. Um, tab. I was looking at the growth chambers, but we need power for that, so I need to make more power. Overcoming your enemies. Well, that's with the woot farm. We're not doing the woot farm. We can make guns and stuff, but I don't really want to. Let's do the, 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 um, the processes anyway, and we'll go from there. Right, so what do we need? What do you need the shaders for? I don't know what those are for. I keep seeing them popping up, but I have no idea. And this is saying that I'm, I don't know. Uh, what was I looking for? Expandive, no, not expanding immersively. Modern technology processors. So we want eight logic processors, four calculation processors, and two engineering processors. We should be able to do that. So we need gold. We need diamonds. We need redstone. I know that much. We need to put the inscriber back on there. Don't, don't we have... Yeah, we have the advanced inscriber. Which I think is better. And that has a cool animation on it. Uh, okay, is that going to show us recipes? No. Well, maybe we do need the inscriber as well. And that's not getting any. Why is this not getting any power? All right, let's take you off then. Um, right, inscriber. I'm oh, still not getting any energy. Don't know why. Okay, what's the first thing we needed? Logic processors. So logic processors are logic processors, the gold processors, silicon and redstone and silicon you get from silicon in the inscriber press and silicon that is certus quartz dust or nether quartz dust we have to we're gonna have to go to the nether soon that's not what i wanted to do uh, uh, we'll have to leave it there for now. 
and of course there's no way to aut oh we have some in there already there's no way to automate this yet see all it's all going back down to to getting more power so does that mean i need to put up because i know you have the lv and the hv line power lines so does that so don't do we have ways of getting lv and hv type power that makes sense because i mean the windmills give you basic power the water wheels give you basic power they only give you so much so to generate more power i'm guessing we need the biodiesel biodiesel and generator that i have bits of sitting in the back so I'm going to have, so everything hinges on that. That's 15. Because I mean, this is taking forever. But once we, once we um get the, 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 the silicon and stuff, then we can open up mechanism and go from there because we might be able to hook up mechanism to the low voltage stuff i don't know if it will get enough power or not but if it does then at least then we'll have access to those machines but we can't know until we open up those tabs right, how many do we have 25 do i have any um i've got seven silicon okay does this burn in the furnace? It does. So we need the silicon inscriber press. Logic silicon. So we put that in the dirt. Oh. It's still in here, isn't it? All right, let's put those there and for now. Put the silicon in the top. We put the... Oh, we had 64 silicon. Although, but you need tons of silicon. Oh, it only takes it one at a time. Okay, I think the ad advanced advanced inscriber that takes it um that can take like a whole stack All right uh, advanced inscriber put that down we want this in the top we want there you go Let's pick up our stuff. So we can put the inscriber back. Where's the inscriber? There. I don't know, it's weird today. My mouse feels very... very loose. And that has that cool animation, which I really like. So that's making lots for us. Um, anything else to put away? No. Right, so that's 10. And then we can also put down, actually we can put down the inscriber and make the other presses one at a time. It's a pain, but it's better than nothing. So to make the logic, we need printed circuit, the gold printed circuit, redstone and the printed silicon. And how many of those did we need? We need eight. All right, so we need eight redstone, seven, eight. Take that, oh, not that, take that out as well. 
we need eight printed silicon and eight gold and we have ten all right that's good all right so we can take this out for now take that out for now gold nope it's all a bit kind of all right what are we missing logic Oh, we need logic circuits. Okay. Logic circuits is this one. So take that out. All right, I need to empty out my inventory. Um, the lime die can go back. I just need two slots and the quartz you see that can come out and the generator can come out too that can go back in and everything else can stay for now right so logic that's gold and that. That. No, it's not going to because we have these other things. That kind of locks it. So you put that there. Put the gold in. And it will make the gold printed circuits. And then we can switch them around. So yeah, so I've seen that some people would make two or three inscribers so they can do several processes at once. And then have that going. So we can put back the extra printed silicon. Actually, that's going pretty fast. Alright, so we've got the gold printed logic, redstone, and the silicon, and then that should give us the logic chips. Yes, logic processors. Then we need four calculation processes and two engineering processes. For calculation, that is um, this thing. Um, they're made from diamonds. For a minute, I oh no, these are made from Certus quartz. It's not diamonds. Calculation presses, circuits. That's pure certus quartz and the calculation press. So we need four of those. We have one already. Pure certus quartz, which is... those calculation press calculation press and that's another quartz why is my aim off okay because I was looking at the wrong thing 
Yeah, nothing to do with my mouse. I was looking at the wrong thing. And then for that we need that and redstone. Okay, so we need four redstone from there. And... Four silicon. Right, let's put those away. I think we'll probably need that in a minute, but that's fine. Take that out. I know for some of you this is painfully slow, but I apologise. But yeah, it's it takes a, it's taken a lot to get my head wrapped around it. Because like I said, it's not anything I've really done before. So it's nice to learn it, even if it is giving me a bit of trouble. Because at least at the end of this, I'll be able to say I did it. And finally, two engineering processes. So that's two diamond, two redstone, two silicon. Well, I think we have all of that done. Two diamond, two redstone, two silicon. So that, so yeah, so some setups I've seen is that people have processes being made and you just put it all together. Are you? Yeah, you've updated now. And let's pick the middle loot chest because we can. Uh, this one we needed. A, oh, choice reward. Oh. I'll go for the calculation circuits because that uses the Certus Quartz and that's harder to find. Okay, brains. We want an Emmy controller. Okay, what do we need to make an Emmy controller? Circuit board. Insulating glass. Okay, we're not doing that yet. Let's open this. Still mechanical components, that's okay. Oh yes, we're supposed to look in the book and see a mechanical upgrades. So, alternative alloying, enriching for success, configuring mechanically, and fancy power transmission. Okay, well let's look at this. Metallurgic Infuser. I've always heard that name, never used it. But now we're going into RF. Okay. Uh, advanced Tech Mod. You can produce up to five ingots per ore, produce millions of RF per tick, and parallel process up to seven items at once. The first step is to get a metallurgic infuser which allo which allows you to infuse iron and osmium ingots with redstone to produce enriched alloy and basic control circuits respectively. The alloy can be further infused with diamonds and refined obsidian to make more advanced alloys for more advanced machines and improve in your cir upgrading your circuits to more advanced versions. Okay, we can try making it. Uh, so we want a metallurgic infuser. Uh, crafting table. Infuse. Basic. These are factories. Okay. Metallurgic infuser. Steel sheet metal, engineering processor, steel sheet metal, energy cell, 
osmium block, generator block. Uh, so we need four steel sheet metal, which I'm pretty sure we have. Do we have another energy block? Were we given another one or was that the only one we were given? Energy block or energy cell? Uh, energy cell. Okay, let's go get some steel to make the sheet metal. There's 18 there. Let's put some of this. We want the generator block. The radiator blocks we can put away. Iron we need. No, smart cable can stay. There's iron sheet metal. Uh, iron sheet metal. Didn't we have steel sheet metal or did I use all of that up? HV capacitor. I don't think I've made any of those. A uh, block of lead. Oh, so... Okay, no. It's okay. I had a bit of a brainwave, but then I don't think... Right, I'm looking for steel. That's what I'm looking for. So is there none in there? Let's have a... A double check. S T E E L steel. All right, we've got steel rods, and eighteen steel. There's none in this. There's none in that. Didn't we have a drawer with steel in it? I'm sure we did. That's nickel. As osmium. Iron, oh steel, there you go. Do we, no, we need steel sheet metal. So we need uh, steel plates. So we need four bits of steel. One, two, three, four. It gives us four sheet met bits of sheet metal. All right. Met in few. Alright, so we've got the four sheet metal, we have the generator block, we need an HV capacitor, an energy cell, and an osmium block. Osmium block we can make because we have tons of osmium. Did I pick up nine? One more. Right, we've got our osmium block. So we've got sheet metal, we have the generator block, we have the osmium block, we have an engineering processor, we need to make the HV capacitor and the energy cell. HV, so we need steel on top, aluminium, block of lead, redstone. Okay, we want a block of redstone. Actually, let's get rid of some of this stuff. So steel, oh no, this is the other type of steel. Get rid of some of these cables. I thought I had a thing for ender pearls, but obviously not. Uh, chest, charcoal, 
Alright, nothing else. Did I put back the osmium? No, the osmium's there. We need a block of redstone. Was it a block of lead or was it three lead? I can't remember. Um, three steel, two aluminium, block of lead. All right, where's the aluminium? That's nickel, silver, tin, uranium. I do have aluminium somewhere. Gold, three aluminium. And two treated wood planks. Which I know I have. Okay, we've got that. And now the energy cell. So we need Certus Quartz. Fluix dust and quartz glass. Alright, so it is, uh, does it have to be fluix dust? Yes, it has to be fluix dust. Which is a shame, really. And how do we get Fluix Dust? Not in the grinder? Crusher, a Fluix Crystal, not the pure one. Do we have any fluids crystals left? Yeah, we do. Right, put that in. Um, quartz glass. Right, we only need one of those. And that's the energy cell. So now we should have, oh, we're just missing the engineering processor. Uh, engineering is one, and we have a metallurgic infuser. All right, let's go, let's put that here. Let's have a look at the interface. Ooh, swanky side config. Okay. Right, none of this means anything to me, but I'm sure it will. So I guess these are the two things you want to alloy, and that's your output. Show recipes. So diamond and enrich alloy will give you that. Tin and copper gives you bronze okay so you can dirt and biofuel gives you podzol alright so it's basically um it's like a uh, an alloy kiln but better how do you make biofuel in the crusher if you put plant matter you get biofuel. Okay. Okay. So what I'm going to have to do is start uh, boning up on um, power. What my power options are. Or not so much what my power options are, but how to get these things to work. Which I'm getting a bit of sense of deja vu. I'm sure I said that. Why is there a hopper there?
That's very random. Okay, never mind. But um but yeah, I'm pretty sure I probably said something like that at the end of the last episode. <laughs> but we need to do it because it is now getting to the point where I need to sort out some kind of power so that I can start powering all these machines properly but we finished off um, oh did I item reward do we get both oh we get both cool fancy energy storage energy transmission oh okay so that's what those cables are for we got those we got those where are they here didn't we <laughs> see we didn't even have to make them we didn't even have to make them Oh wow, that gave us, that opened up four things. And doesn't consume them either, okay. So we got those as quest rewards. And now that opens up all of this stuff. Okay, that's not bad. So at least we have cables for days. We now need a mechanism chest. I think. Because these don't stack, so we don't have any room. Let's move that out and put that there. Right, so... Oh, we've got more stuff over here. So yeah, so we did we did good I think. We we opened up quite a few quest lines. But yeah, I'm gonna have to look and see how to set up my power properly. And I think probably what I need to do, instead of having um the L V connectors here, I need to have like H V connectors. Not connectors, um the capacitors. If I have the HV capacitors, then I could hook up the machines and get power going to them and stuff. At least that's what I think it is. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But um, thanks for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.